Hi, welcome back to another tutorial. Today I'm going to guide you on how to manually blend multiple exposures in Photoshop. Blending images in Photoshop is a popular technique used by real estate photographers and editors. So we are going to import the images in Lightroom. We have here seven images containing four ambience and three flashes. And we are going to move them to Photoshop where we will do the manual blending. Select the seven images, right click, select edit in, then select open as layer. In Photoshop, we are going to separate the flash images and the ambient. Group them and make the ambient images as your base photo. Now we will start to blend those images. First we will blend the ambient images and hide the flash folder. Then choose the middle exposure in the ambient group as your base photo. Then add inverted masking to each image except the base photo. Press Alt and click the masking button. That's how you get an inverted masking. So we are going to recover the blown out areas of the base photo. We will use the dark images in the ambient group. By using the brush tool, set its opacity and flow to 30% for easier control of the brush stroke. Then start brushing. When you are done recovering the blown out areas, the next thing to recover is the dark areas on the base photo. Select the bright ambient image and start brushing slowly. Now we will move on to the flash exposure. Unhide the folder and make the images visible. Same as what we did on the ambient, we will add inverted masking. The darkest flash exposure will be used as the window view. Start masking it. And the surrounding area of the window is a bit overexposed, so we are going to recover some of it, especially the curtains. Next thing to do is to recover the lights. I used the second exposure to recover it. I also recovered some on the ceiling, floor, and window area. Then just keep blending till everything is well blended. Just remember when doing manual blending, always make your brush opacity in a minimal amount. This is to avoid a heavy brush stroke while blending. When you are done, click Save. In the Lightroom, proceed to adding a preset on it or do the basic edit. That's all. Thank you for watching. I hope you find this video helpful. I'll see you guys in the next one.